Thunder Coffee's specialty is putting a spin on your average cup of java. The Valley Today's Abby Birchner is getting an inside look at how they come up with some of their ideas. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, guys. I'm here with Nicole Dunton with Thunder Coffee, and Thunder Coffee has so many different unique coffee flavors. Yeah. How do you guys come up with those, cr that creative process for those? Right. Well, it really starts with uh, flavors that we know and flavors that we like, and then we test out new things. So we kind of lead with our nose, I guess, because part of taste is what you smell. So we actually start with um, some of these different flavors, like I have um, nutmeg, cardamom, juniper berries, um, cinnamon, orange, all of these things, and we, we smell them, we try to figure out what would go good together, and then we start tasting them <laughs> together. So it's a lot of trial and error with mm -hmm. you with Thunder Coffee. Yes, it is. Yeah, we um, just get a bunch of ingredients, put them on the table, and then we start mixing drinks. And while you do have creative drinks, you also have your standard coffees as well. Yeah, so we always start with the basics of the regular latte, the mocha, and cold brew, and then we expand from there. And let's talk a little bit how Thunder Coffee got started. How did you come up with that perfect first drink and you were like, yes, this is what we want to do? Well, a big part of the staple drink is really just uh, tasting what other places have made and then trying to recreate that and then tweaking it a little bit here and there so it tastes more like your own. What do you think is your most creative drink that you guys have come up with? Ooh, I'd say the um, maple bourbon bacon was probably one of the most creative ones. And I think we did that on your guys' show a little while ago. Oh my gosh, that sounds like it should be a donut. <laughs> it, it could it be. <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's really cool. It's uh, cold brew, bourbon, and uh, bacon, and it's just a really neat drink. Um, it's one of our partnerships with Proof that we've done, but we've done uh, a lot of other cool ones, uh, like the cold mule. Mm, uh, that yeah. one's really neat, and then we try just different flavors for syrups, and it's just trying to be unique, trying to be different. So many unique things, honestly. And I'm so excited because in just a few minutes, we'll be getting a creative fall drink that we'll be testing out here this morning. I love that they think outside the box. I've tried a few of those drinks too, the, the bourbon maple uh, drink. Ooh, that sounds you know? good. Oh, it was good, it really was, something different. Okay, I'm excited for what you're gonna make. I'll check in with you again soon. Thank you, Abby. Family, friends, and a, <clears throat> excuse me, community are in shock.